So if you're not one of the fortunate few that have an unlimited data plan, you probably manage your data usage pretty closely. So let me show you one tip that will help you manage that. If you notice, uh, let me, before I go in there, let me zoom in right here. You notice how I have this um, do not kind of uh, warning sign, you know, an exclamation point coming up. Well, basically, that's a setting that I've enabled because I've chosen to set up specific warnings when I've hidden my data caps. So I'm going to go into settings, and once I go into settings, I'm going to go into data usage. And what I'm doing is I'm establishing that I should set a warning when I get to 1.8 gigabytes. Notice down here it says that I've already reached 1.8 gigabytes, so that's why I can have that warning up there. So I can adjust this by adjusting this. It kind of tells me where I'm going to set my data limit. Right? So you notice that that little um, symbol disappeared because my warning is now set at 3.4. So depending on what your plan is and depending on what your cycle is, what you can do is you can set certain thresholds so that you get notified before you hit that cap. So let's say if your cap is, let's say um, you have a 6 gig plan, go down all the way down to 6, uh, right there. You may not want to set it at six. You may want to say, I want to be notified when I'm at five and a half, or you can even say, I want a one gig threshold. So give me a warning, right? Um, you could also set data limits um, as well. So if I choose a data limit, basically what will happen is it will disable it so that at, at a certain point, I can no longer use data and not incur any overages. So you notice now I have two lines. I have my warning and then I have my data limit. So my data limit is at six, my warning is at five. And this is a great way to really control your data usage and not go into any type of overage situations when you're using uh, plans that don't have unlimited data.